Hey look, it's me, Baderfish, back with some more Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Last time we made our way out of the Kokiri Forest and into Hyrule Castle Town, did some stuff, got a slingshot bag, and ooh, wow, shiny. And this time we continue to go around Hyrule Castle Town, pick up anything that we missed, and then maybe we will find out who that Princess Zelda lady is. Who knows? Also, this is recorded afterward because I was doing the episode too long last time, so I'm just kind of jumping into where I was recording. Might be a little awkward. Have fun. Hmm, so this is the back alleys here. I like never go in these, so I'm never sure what's here. Hey. What? What's wrong with loitering around all day? Oh, huh, kid. Uh, I have a point. Strange, this door doesn't open. I mean, it's almost like people lock their doors because they don't want people going in, but... It seems strange that packs of dogs roam our streets at night. Doesn't that seem weird to you? Is there a door right there? Uh, I guess not. Looked like there was. Ah. How far do you have to go? Is that just a wall? Really? A dead end? Nope. As I said, I have no clue where anything is. Hey, Sonny. You don't have enough wise. It's like that one meme where it's like, the more wise you have, the more interesting you are. I'll, uh, post that in here. I heard there was a mysterious fountain somewhere near the castle. Uh. Cool, a fountain. I don't remember what he's talking about. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm not gonna spoil it, but uh, just so you know, I have played this game before, like several times. So, uh, anything in here other than this table? Nope. And is this open? Strange. This door doesn't open. Wow. I could make the exact same joke. All right. So that's that side. Oh, there's a door right here. I didn't go in this. Forgive me. Uh. Treasure chest contest, temporary closed, open tonight. So as we've seen, there's a lot of stuff that we will come back to when it is the night time. So we will do that later. But all right, let's head in this shop. It's got a nice smiley face on it. So oh, no longer smiley. That's just freaky, but whatever. What a strange shop. I wonder when it'll be open for business. I read this sign there, but it still seems weird. Yeah, let's read the sign. Happy Math Shop! Please read this sign before you use this shop. How the shop works. We do not sell masks at the shop, we just lend them to you. You sell the loan masks on your own. Why can't we just buy them then? If we can sell them to other people. You pay back the money for the mask, and we will lend you a new model. You can buy a mask. You have already sold again. However, you can only sell each model of mask once. Please try our shop. Happy Mask Shop owner. So that is something we will do later. It's a side quest of sorts. Okay, uh, let's head up to here. This is called the Temple of Time, as that uh, one lady said. There's these funny looking guys. The statue's one eyes gaze pierces into your soul. And if you bop it, it'll say, boing boing, the current time is 1348. So that's how you can check the time in the game to know. So it's afternoon. You can get the day night cycle down. Welcome to the Temple of Time. Hmm, it doesn't seem to be much we can do. What does this say? There are three hollows and an inscription here. Ye who owns three spiritual stones, stand with the Ocarina of Time and play the Song of Time. That is what how the inscription reads. Alright, there's this big door right here. So, I wonder what's back here. There actually is a glitch where you can glitch past this door. I don't know how to do it. I think you like back with the door or something. Uh, there's a similar glitch in Majora's Mask, which I actually managed to pull off one time. Which was cool, because I never deal with glitches and stuff, but... Although people who do are pretty cool. Those, like, glitch people, or I don't know what they're even called. But, forgive me, but, you know. I respect those people. Okay, let's head in here. Potion shop. Alright, well, he's got all these things. Fish. Po. Bug. Deku nuts. And here are the potions. So, there's two kinds of potions. Ones that recover your life and ones that recover your magic. And there's a blue fire and a fairy. We will see those later. We don't have anything to hold those with, except Deku nuts, which we already have 20 of. 
what's in here? Wow, wow. Bow, do, do, do. Welcome. All right, he's got arrows, Deku stick. Oh, maybe I'll buy some because I'm short. A Hylian shield, 80 rupees. And then there's all this stuff. I'm going to buy a Deku stick because I don't want to spend my money. Because it's burning a hole in my pocket and I don't want to max out. Match A. Sweet, now I got three. Kind of weird that a shop sells sticks. <laughs> that is pretty funny now that I think about it. Now you can get a stick without even having to go to the park. Let's head in here. Oh, it's the Hyrule Field song. Let's head over here. Hey, Link, this way. The princess is inside the castle just ahead. Be careful not to get caught by the guards. <laughs> On this ground, time flows normally. Time stands still while you are in Lamon Ranch or in a town. If you want time to pass normally, you'll need to leave town. Well, well, which way are you going to go now? Hoo hoo hoo! Do you want. No! And they switched up to yes no again. Ah, I hate this guy! I mean, he's an alright character, but ah, the stupid repeating text. He wasted, like. Collectively, he's probably wasted, like, 20 minutes of my time since I was, like, three. And I've spent a lot more than that just staring at the wall. Alright, well, run into this tree and you get yourself a gold sculpture. Can you stun this? I guess not. Ooh, I don't know. It's popping with a stick. Yeah, that was 10 rupees. Alright, that is gold sculpture number 4, I want to say. Sweet. A uh, token. Alright, so you will notice it is getting nighttime and stuff, but. What do you have to say? So, you say you want to see Princess Zelda, eh? You probably heard about her in town and decided you had to meet her. Well, go home, get out of here. The princess would never grant an audience to the likes of you. I've got a masked emerald, how about I bribe you? Just kidding, you can't do that. Alright, well let's wait for, uh... How do you say night? Alright, well... Let's head back into town and do a couple of things in... Night. What do you have to say? Kids shouldn't be wandering around town at night time. Stay indoors until morning. Kids shouldn't be wandering around town at night time. That's the same thing. Yawn. Hold the cow. I have a bad habit with yawning, and it's hard because I can't stop it. Uh, hello, dog. All right. Well, these people are still out. Who needs sleep when you have love? Just kidding, it's called me. I love sleep. It's the closest you can get to death while still being alive. Seems like it's taken forever to dawn to come. Something, something, high in the castle. Let's head back here. Oh, actually, let's check out this place. Oh no. I had a realization. Open the chest, and surprise! If you find a key inside, you'll be able to advance. Left or right, try your luck. Ten rupees. Ah. <laughs> Is this what depression feels like? Okay, let's... Ouch. Go through the alley. Maybe some of those doors will be open, because people generally tend to leave their doors unlocked at night time. You know, so people can sneak in. Uh, sounds like a shop to me, but uh, there's no one here. I believe that it's later in the game there was a shop there. Maybe I should have gone over this later. Haley, it's this one lady. I can't find my puppy anywhere. I need you to look for it, please. All right, so one of those dogs outside is her puppy, and we should go and find it, because puppies. I don't even think you need an explanation. It's a it's a puppy. Hmm. Yum. Bark bark. All right. Is this door open now or? Yeah, it is. Is anyone in here? Is this the one beard guy? It seems strange that packs of dogs. From... You said the same thing. Or maybe someone else said that, and you are copying him. 
Oh, I forget how fun the little, uh, the songs, the, the house songs and potion shop. And... All right, come here, white dog. We're going to go with the white dog first. I mean, I don't think I need to explain why, but come on, dog. I mean, she did say your dog was faster, so let's, let's see. Uh, which, is it this, this door? <laughs> I don't remember. Hopefully it is. Yeah, I think it is. Speak. Arg! This is not my dog. How could you mix up my puppy with a mutt like that? Lady, they all look the same. I can't remember which dog it is, so we're just gonna trial and error the heck out of this thing. Cue montage. Little Richard, thank you, thank you. I'll give this to you as a reward. We got a pizza heart. Collect four pieces for a heart container. Uh, I skipped past that. All right, was that second piece of heart? I probably didn't do an in. Wait, that's a, that's our first one. All right, so yeah, you get four and you get next to heart container. I will do a little pop up boy for that. Like I do for the gold sculpture list. Alright, now I think that's everything we can do. So let's try heading over and... Something something. Hyrule Castle. Princess Zelda. Bop, bop, bop. Hey. Having a good night? Are you going to the castle, fairy boy? Would you mind finding my dad? He must have fallen asleep somewhere around the castle. What a thing for an adult to do. <laughs> oh yeah, if you look for him, I'll give this to you. I've been incubating this egg very carefully. <laughs> you got a weird egg. Feels like there's something moving inside. Ugh, I'm mashing A, but it doesn't go faster, and I don't like that. Anything else to say, or... Why do you have to... Skip past that. This game lets you skip. Ah! Clemens finds this stupid. There's the one spot where you can't do it very well. But yeah, you wanna go right on that one. Ah, I could listen to you sing all day. Now. Boing boing. 23, 25. Alright, um, we could continue over there, but there is a guard. Wait, what is. What is that? Wait, that's a clock? What? Is there like a clock from the other angle? I gotta see this. That's just a flipping statue. Ah. I'm gonna cut back to the top of the bridge. Hey, look, that chicken hatched. Yeet. Alright, so you can jump down or you can go through here. And I'm gonna go through here. Why is there... I don't know, that fire kind of looked at but I don't know. It's, it's cool, I guess. Alright, let's equip that chicken. <laughs> it's a chicken. I like how... I mean, Link keeps a lot of things down his pants. You know, sticks and slingshots, but... A live chicken is definitely one of the weirdest. Dead end. Mm, yeah, I don't see any pants in here either. Alright, well, there's some guards right there, so you gotta sneakity sneak around them. This always gives me anxiety, sneaking around them, but it's actually not that bad. I mean, I don't know how you're not seeing us, because it's like, oh look, that's a guard. And he's looking kind of at us. He probably hears, us, you know, ah, ah, all of these sounds that Link likes to make. He is not very good at stealth, but these guards are very bad at their job, so it balances out. Ah, look at that castle. Simply beautiful. Alright, so there are guards right there, so... The other guy who's not going to use the moat, so how about we do the same? And we get some sweet, sweet money. 
I mean, it's not very much money, but hey, money is money. The wise man once said, having money is good. Oh, what do you have to say? The girl from the ranch said, find her dad. Hmm, well, I can certainly hear something snoring. Uh, I thought it was supposed to be. Oh, and this right here is the final boss of the game. My future girlfriend's dad. Let's wake this boy up. What in tall nation? Can a person get a little shut eye around here? Hello, and who might you be? Yep, I'm Talon, the owner of Lon Lon Ranch. I went to the castle to deliver some milk, but I sat down here to rest, and I guess I fell asleep. <laughs> what? Malin was looking for me? I'm gonna catch it from her now! I messed up bad leaving Malin behind to wait for me. She's really gonna let me have it! When I was a kid, I was like, wait, why is he running to the guards? He's gonna get caught. And now that I'm older, I'm like, oh, he is supposed to be here, unlike us, who's the filthy criminal. I'm sure we have a good reason. I mean, a tree told us to be here, so... Yeah, that's a good reason. Alright, so, there's that little hole the guy was talking about. No, get down there. So, if we push these blocks over there, his tip for Zelda, if you ever see a block that you can push, you get to push it, because that's how something something foreshadowing works. I don't know. Is that foreshadowing? I don't know. Or just game design. You could try to go through this door, but, uh... Well, the camera's not angling on me. No, don't go up there. You can't, for some reason. There's a wall right there. I've always thought that was kind of weird. It'd be funny if you could go in there, and it would be a bunch of guards, and they'd catch you, but... Eh. It's, it's, it's fine, I guess. Alright, so here's something I don't think I've actually ever done, is this section at night time, for, uh, for some strange reason, so... I, I'm kind of tempted to see what this is going to be like. Push. Push. We did it. And then we jump through here. I mean, our clothes are going to get wet, but hey, we're doing it for a girl, so the rules don't apply. Oh, there's guards. Ah. Can we just... Heck. That's what happens if a guard sees you. I would just get punted back to right here. <laughs> That's why I never do it at night time. Because you can't. Alright, well I'm going to just shut up right here and speed things up. Or cut things. We'll see. Oops, second episode in a row. This is what's getting really long, so I'll see you guys next time.